Young, and I'm so excited because Father's Day will be here before you know it, which means you and I need to get creative for our fathers. I've got several really cute ideas, and I'm gonna start with one using our card carrier die set. And I love this set here because you can do so many things with it, and today we're gonna get really fancy. Are you ready for this? So I went ahead and I ran it through my machine. I have two pieces that are already cut, and I'm gonna take the zigzag edge off with our paper cutter. And usually I leave that on if I'm gonna make any sort of a gift bag, but for today, and because we want this to be a little more masculine, I'm just gonna put it right underneath the paper cutter, line it up as just as straight as you can, and cut that off. And we're gonna get rid of this part here. And then you wanna pull your journey glue, and we're gonna glue these two pieces together. And the Journey Glue holds the cardstock so well. It's my favorite crafting glue. And I went ahead and fold. If you can see here, when you run it through your die cutting machine, you'll notice that there are lines for you to follow. And just for the sake of the video, I went ahead and just, just, followed on, just folded on the lines like it kind of tells us to do. And now I'm gonna use the Journey Glue. Let's see. It's kind of like a puzzle. Let's turn it around. Okay, so on this side right here where it just has one folded edge, I'm gonna put a little glue along the line. And we're gonna fold it and attach it to our second piece of paper. So you'll notice on this side, okay, so that you guys can see, let me fold it, let me show you really good. We're folding, see here, right here, there's two little lines, can you guys see that? They can see that in the light, can't they? Yeah, there we go. So you don't wanna get it turned around. You're just gonna hold it there for a few minutes. But see, there's two pieces here, and then if you flip it over, you'll notice we just folded the one side that has the one fold. And we're gonna bring it in. Let's put a little more glue on the other side that has the single little fold. And we're gonna attach that, just like so. And then this bottom part, we are gonna fold, just like it's a box, let's fold it into shape here. And then we're gonna take our scissors and we wanna slice it right in the middle. And we're gonna fold this like it's an open shirt, like it's a button down shirt, maybe your dad wears. Okay, and the best part is, you guys, look at this really cute little tie. I'm gonna attach that right underneath here where it looks like the tie is attached to the shirt. Isn't that precious? So we have this for you all. We freehanded this, but we created a downloadable so that you don't have to. You can go to our website, funstampersjourney.com, and you can download that straight from the blog. I'll actually put the link at the top of this video so you can get straight to it. So if you have little hands at home, they can help you maybe cut around the edge. I'm gonna glue this bottom to my box too. Sometimes when you um, make the boxes, I love the card carrier set, but you do, it's kind of like you play with it. And if you don't do it all the time, you kind of just build it like you're building a box at home. You just kind of put the pieces together and it tells you, I mean, it gives you, it gives you a guideline to follow, but you just kind of play with it until you get it right and exactly how you like it. Isn't that cute? So inside the box, I'm gonna put a little bit of paper shred. You guys know paper shred is life. I love paper shred. You could include maybe a coupon for a special little treat that you're gonna do for your dad if maybe you're gonna clean his car or maybe you're gonna pick up his dry cleaning or I don't know, whatever it is that your dad loves. You could put a little coupon in there. Um, you could put a little candy bar or a treat. There's so many things that would fit in this little box. And the last thing that I'm gonna do, I wanna embellish the box with a cute tag. We used our Journey Circle um, die and I ran it through. And all I've done, you all, is I've just taken white paper and I've stamped it with our party. Look how cute this set is. If you don't have it, this is a really, really good one. Even if you just use the Happy Father's Day, I love the font of this. So just stamped it and I'm gonna attach it to the little bag. Um, Let's use, a, let's use some string, let's brighten it up. Wanna do that? And what I'll do is maybe put the string kind of behind the little tag and I have this really cute little wooden uh, clothespin. Let's put it to the side over here. 
there we have it, you guys. A cute little gifty that your dad is going to love. All right, so this is one of a series of three or four. We have so many good projects, so stay tuned. Be on the lookout. Check out the Facebook pages. We'll be sharing them on funstamperjourney.com. You can also check them out at uh, certifiedcelebrator.com, and we promise we're going to give you all the ideas you're possibly going to need to make your Father's Day extra special.